Am I lost or am I exactly where I am? must be. Brought out only the good stuff for you, Red. Seeing as you got that whistle blowing. Hey, I've been waiting to get my lucky hammer fixed for days. You haven't done anything useful like getting rid of any bristlebacks, though, have you? Take your time. I promise you won't be disappointed. Come back anytime. Now can I get this fixed? I can fix your tools. Afraid there's no fixing you. Well, that depends on what Do I have to say it every time? <laughs> every time. I know you see me. So you got a lucky yes, armor. I I like buy me one more drink and I'll talk. Keep your hammer. Got a scrapper off my back. First gig out of the claim. Never go in here without it. Oi, this. Nora yeah. in the 
I'm drunk with you! <laughs> I've heard of your adventure. My armor can help. I could take her. You look like someone you need to No, you see me. Yeah, got work to do. 
Some of us are trying to drink. I've heard of your adventure. My armor can help. Make good use of it. Ignoring me again? So you got a lucky hammer that needs fixing, huh? <laughs> Maybe finally someone who will outdrink me, huh? Never go anywhere without it. Got a problem? Uh, 
Tavern's brewmaster can't be too happy that whistle blows, well, that's for sure. <laughs> I just want to see. How goes it, Hammerhead? Armor is my trade. This will really boil their broth. I'll add a sprinkle of chili to their desserts. Help reverse.
Yes. Something else? I need to go. Of course. Stuff for the stash. The way to Baron Light is clear. Get moving. You're not Aaron Vanguardsman. I will move only when the captain says. When I've cleared out all the bristlebacks, which I have. Captain's orders. So they're okay. Banged up, but breathing, and waiting up ahead for you. But, but I, I was supposed to have three escorts. I'm off to Baron Light, buddies. Like Aloy said, captain's orders. You can stay here. Abandoned to the riffraff? I think not. Guess you're coming with me then. See you there, Aloy. Done. The embassy can finally get underway. If I can get through it, I'll be able to track down silence. Hades. <sighs> Maybe even a guy at backup. Guess I could head straight for Baron Light. Or poke around the daunt some more first. And maybe take Petra up on that drink.
There's a big deal in the claim, and don't you deny it. Look, I ain't saying they ain't got this far. George knows if I had bristlebacks in my backyard, I'd close my gates too. That, yeah. Change your mind about that brew? Come for that beer after all, eh? Here, sit down. Get a pint in her hand. Wasn't expecting you to swing by. Since when do I do what's expected? Ha! There's that spark. Fire and spit. Uh, fire and spit. That's a blast from the bellows. Won't fix the forge, but at least I can forget about my troubles for a while. Like what? Well, things aren't as bad since you got this place running again. But we still got Olven grating the gears about his concession decree. If you don't put that down, I'll come over there and show you how that game ends. Anyway, right now, I'm just worried about those refugees out from Sunfall. To come all this way, enduring Forge knows what. Shadow Carja refugees. What are they doing in the Daunt? Mm, looking for a new home, I gather. They're camped out by an old trailhead, southwest of here. And therein lies the problem. A stormbird crashed up on the cliffs last week, and Tallinn Clean Brokers had his eye on the salvage ever since. But the refugees have barred entrance. Mustn't interrupt their sun scorched ritual. Something about finding a twilight path. Huh. I never heard them talk about that before. Yeah, well, these particular Shadow Karja are an odd bunch, but overall they're peaceful folk. Not that it matters to Tolland. He'll crack some heads to get to that salvage. Maybe you could swing by, convince him to set up camp somewhere else? So the bristlebacks in the daunt. <sighs> Where did they come from? 
That's the thing. Not they just showed up one day, rampaging around, lost some good people. But bless that put a dent in Olvin's plans. Now, if only there was some way to smash them all together and run them out of town. But how could Bristlebacks and the Daunt help Olvind? Two words. Concession decree. Since no one knows where Olvind has taken to blaming the... He's hoping to dig up until the concession sign. This is just his latest attempt. He's been trying to rile up the workers since the... And people actually believe him? Lots of folk give him half a reason. Ah, damn Korja slavers. I thought you'd be back. Well, I but realized it. Heard about the rebuilding. I've been scraping by every... You could always... And go back eat. Besides... What else can you tell me about the Shadow Carja refugees? Well, they don't call themselves Shadow Carja for one. At least, not anymore. They're some other brand of sun crazed. But whatever side of the sun they're on, they're peaceful through and through. Don't seem to want for nothing except a place to live, pray, and just enough food to keep from starving. So they're just camped outside by a trail, blocking entry to a wrecked stormbird, waiting for what exactly? Don't rightly know, but I'll tell you this. Should they ever wise up and salvage it? A Stormbird heart is worth a lot. And if they get there first, then by Ostrom Law, it's theirs. Not that Tolan Cleanbroker has ever lost sleep over any law breaking. Who is this Tolan Cleanbroker? Just some chuff huffing pawnsman. Got a shop here in town. Lived in Chain Scrape since there was a Chain Scrape. He and Alvin go back a ways. Like a pair of coals in a campfire, those two. So Talland works for Alvin? Ha! <laughs> Alvin might think so. But Talland scrapes up his own scams. And he ain't the type to let a few refugees get between him and Stormbird Salvage. So about Alvin? Around here, everything's about Alvin. How'd he end up in charge? He got here early. He knew rebuilding barren life. So he jank getting investors to front claims. Thing is, all the bankers back home know that this is... And the sun came... That's why he's... This concession decree... It's pig diddle, that's what. A writ that would put all Osram claims in the dawn, even though they're on car... It would mean that stone and timber... No more risk. A claim to pour... And since old... It would make him richer than a... Not to mention chains... So he could buy... He's a sly old... Ba figures if he keeps up... Well, if I'm up that way, I'll talk to the refugees. Try to convince them to move. Much appreciated. They have it rough. Don't need Tallinn making it rougher. Even the Tallinn has a shop here in Chainscreen. I should try. have a word with him first. It's a Tanakh game, but any tribe can enjoy it. Hey, Ray. Fancy a game of strike. Ray, 
Fred, welcome back. Oh, that's okay. We can always play later. I'm sorry, I'll be right with you. Uh... Okay, I'm not saying it's a bad idea. I'm saying it's overkill. It's a weapon! Kill is the point. Not if it blows the user's arm off! Oh, just, just, just stop talking! Where are we? Ah! <clears throat> so, uh... You, you look like someone who's always searching for a new weapon. Am I right? Actually, I... <laughs> But you're just not! I am with a customer! I... I'm not a customer. I got it! Triple the powder! It'll blow a strider sky high! Ba boom One shot kill. Guaranteed. Uh... Maybe I am. Then you are in the right place at the right time, Red! How would you like to be the proud owner of the world's first machine-enhanced... Explosive, done-in-one, machine-wrecking... Yet perfectly safe... Javelin Thrower. Are you two from around here? Nah, the claim. Dad sent us out west in search of some unknown opportunity. Said we'll know it when we see it. Sounds like you had other ideas. Let's just say that opening another trading post for my parents isn't how I want to make my mark in this world. <sighs> I imagine traveling alone must be nice. So, she's your partner? My apprentice. And my sister. She's why we're out here. It was an incident. Another incident. Involving explosives? Ba-boom! And Dad's precious homebrew. He shipped us out the next day. Huh. Tell me more about this weapon of yours. I saw a scroll when I was a kid by some Karsha scholar who wandered out west. I had a scary drawing of a Tanakh warrior hunting with a kind of javelin thrower. Effective? Yes. Basic? Undoubtedly. But coming out here made me remember it, and I am on the brink of vastly improving the tool's archaic design. Whereas I will perfect it. I can use machine parts to enhance the user's throw, increase the projectile's velocity. Well, Boomer here is adamant that enhancing the projectile is better. Namely, with explosive tips. Boomsticks. Why not both? That... could work. There's one small snag. I need the parts to make the first working model. Well, for starters, I'll need... Charger horns. Intact. Yeah, that. Just be sure to shoot them off before the machine goes down, otherwise they break. But the real innovation, and keep it to yourself, is a fanghorn rib. There's a mean one east of here. Blow it sky high. Foomer! You get them for me. It's yours. My treat. You have a deal. I should have a charger horns for Della and Boomer now. Just need a rib from that fanghorn they were talking about.
past Thurless old shop and tripped over one of his stupid wires. Faster, I find a charger to override. I'll check it out as I go. Rumor said that Fanghorn should be nearby. This will be in my stash when I need it. Take it down to get its rib. No good. Gotta keep up the fight and build my stamina.
still in this fight. I can grab this from my stash later. Got everything I need for Della and Boomer. Now, I have to see about that weapon of theirs. in my hands. I've given it all that I've got, friend. But you're welcome to keep practicing here.
like a hammer to your head? Just give the to Yeah! Oh. Yeah! yeah. Moon Slash. This attack will help you close on the enemy. And it's a good way to chain combination together or get out of them. No need for Della and Boomer. Now, to see about that weapon of theirs. move is called the Half Moon Slash. This attack will help you close on the enemy. And it's a good way to chain combination together or get out of them. I should go. I'll be here if you want to practice more. I know that look. You've got all the parts, haven't you? Here you go. Outstanding! I only need a few minutes to finish the prototype. I'll take the version that won't blow my arms off. Thanks. Hi. So did you blow up any machines to get the parts? Or any bandits? You really like explosions, huh? Here we go. With the boomsticks? Oh, you betcha. Um, is it safe? Probably. Can I have one? No! Ah. Oh. Cause we're gonna make you something even better. Ba boom blaze that would use? No way.
now. 